Hey guys, your assignment today is to create a welcome to fourth grade. You have to add text and pictures to this giant four to represent you and what you're looking forward to in fourth grade. So it's basically an all about you number four. So you're like, okay, I opened this on my iPad. This is what it looks like because guys, I am on an iPad. So this is what it should look like. And you're like, well, I don't really know how to add pictures. I don't know how to add text. So that's what I'm gonna show you. If you click this plus button right here, it says text, image, shape, whatever. So I want you to click on image first and say you already have an image in your camera roll that you would like to add. You're gonna click from photos, maybe picture of your family or someone, and you're gonna click on whatever picture you want. Now it is gonna show up pretty huge. So you're gonna, you see these boxes on the corners? All you have to do is click those boxes and move them in. Hold your finger down, move them in until you have it the size you want it. You can even press this little circle at the top and you can move it around however you want it and put it on the image. All right, if you click out, it'll go away. Now, say you're like, well, Miss Simpson, I don't have any pictures in my camera roll. Let's go to Safari. That is that little blue thing right here. And you can Google like cactus clip art like I have or anything clip art. You can Google anything as long as it is school appropriate. You're gonna choose one, so click it. And it's gonna open up on the side right there. If you hold your finger down, this little menu is gonna pop up and you can click add to photos. Now, you double click and go back to welcome to fourth grade. Click the plus button. Click image, choose from photos. The, that cactus is right there where you added it. And now again, just click these little squares to resize. Click the circle to make it, you know, a little weird looking or sideways looking, I mean. And then you can click outside of it to make the boxes go away. Okay, so if you want to click image and put click from camera you can take a selfie and put your selfie in there or a picture of your family or your dog or whatever and put it in there that's perfectly fine um but let's try one more time from safari so double click your home button click on safari and you're going to google whatever you want i've already googled spaghetti clip art i'm going to choose this one i'm going to hold my finger down and click add to photos now that it's in my photos i'm going to double click the home button Go back to slides, and then I'm gonna click that plus button. When you click the plus button, this is how you add anything into a Google slide. So you're gonna click image from, fo oops, from photos, and then you can choose that spaghetti. So you can just drag the corners to make it smaller, put it in the middle, and you can turn it a little bit to make it cute or whatever. Say you don't like the image that you added. You click whatever you don't like, this little black line is going to pop up and you can click delete and it'll go away. If you're like, oh, I didn't mean to delete that. Up at the top, there's little arrows. You click them, it'll undo what you did. So the one that goes to the left will undo it. This, the one to the right will go forward. So that one goes back and you can even undo the things that you did or redo the things you did. All right, so now let's add text. So you click that, you add text, type whatever you want to type. So I'm going to put my nickname is DJ Simpson. And it is because at school I play all kinds of music all the time. So the kids here call me DJ Simpson. So do the teachers. Okay, so you're gonna put it wherever you want it for now. And how you move images is all you do is put your finger and you can just drag it around. So just tap it with your finger. Ooh, not that hard because that's going to mess it up. Tap it with your finger and you can move it around. Okay. So now click back into your text. And I want you to click the A in the upper right hand corner. So this one right here. I'm going to do that again so you can see it. This one right here. You can go to font and you can change the font of this. I like this one so I'm going to choose that one. And then click back. You can make it bigger by clicking the up arrow or smaller by clicking the down arrow. You can change the color. So say you want pink, you'll click pink and then you'll choose one of the pinks that pops up. I like this one. So I'm gonna go back by clicking back on here and make it bigger. I'm gonna adjust it and I, whoa. 
Remember, if you mess up, just hit this back button up here and you're good. I keep doing that, guys. Now I can move it around and call it good. If you need any help, hop onto Google Meets and I would be happy to help you. I love you guys. Have fun.